Hi friends, I am Mrs. Hebler and I am a first grade teacher in the Brasserie neighborhood. And I wanted to introduce myself because some of you might even have me as a teacher next year or you'll see me in the hallways. And it's always nice to see somebody that you kind of already know and you might know my name. Um, today I'm going to read a story to you called Peanut Butter and Cupcake. And the author is Terry Border. And I love this story because it kind of has a rhyme. You follow a character named Peanut Butter and you watch as he starts to find a good friend for him. And so this is so important, especially at the beginning of the school year or even at school, it, finding friends is really what's special for us. So let's take a peek at Peanut Butter and Cupcake. I love the illustrations in this book too. It's so fun. I'll make sure I get it nice and close to the video. It says, Peanut Butter got a ball for his birthday. He was kind of bad at kicking it with his feet, but kind of good at balancing it on his head. Still, it wasn't much fun playing with a ball all by himself. Want to play with me? He asked his mom. They had just moved to town and Peanut Butter didn't have any friends yet. I think you should go outside and find someone to be your new friend, she answered. Peanut Butter liked that idea very much, so off he went. It wasn't long before he saw someone. maybe later or even all day. I'll make you chuckle deep down in your belly and we'll go together like peanut butter and hamburger. I'm sorry, said hamburger. I'm busy walking the dogs. Thanks for asking though. Do you get it? The hot dog. You're welcome, said peanut butter. Maybe next time. And he kept walking. Then he saw Cupcake playing by herself. He thought she looked sweet and might make a good friend. Hello, I'm new here and I'd like to play. Maybe now, maybe later, or even all day. I'll make you chuckle deep down in your belly and we'll go together like peanut butter and Cupcake. I'm building sprinkle castles, said Cupcake. You can stay and watch, but don't hit my castle with your ball or I'll be mad. Peanut Butter didn't want to make anyone mad. That's okay, Peanut Butter said, and he kept walking. Anybody feeling bad for Peanut Butter? Then he saw Egg rolling down the path. Hello, I'm new here and I'd like to play. Maybe now, maybe later, or even all day. I'll make you chuckle deep down in your belly and we'll go together like peanut butter and egg. Peanut butter and egg? That's funny. You're cracking me up. Egg laughed. And then he really did crack. Peanut butter didn't want the egg to laugh anymore, so he kept walking. He found someone jumping. I'm new here and I'd like to play. Maybe now, maybe later, or even all day. I'll make you chuckle tea down in your belly and we'll go together like peanut butter and meatball. 32, 33, 34. Shh, I'm counting my jumps. She said meatball. 35, 36, 37. I'm trying to set a new record. Peanut butter whispered back. But I have this ball in 38, 39, 40. Shh, said Meatball. Peanut Butter kept walking. Finding a friend was harder than he thought it was going to be. I don't know about you guys, but I love how Peanut Butter's introducing himself. He's got a game to play. He's telling his name. He's asking if they could play all day politely. All these foods, I don't know if they're being so nice back. Then Peanut Butter saw another someone sitting under a tree. And that was good because he was ready to sit down too. Even though he was getting tired, he gave it another try. 
hello, I'm new here and I'd like to play. Maybe now, maybe later, even all day. I'll make you chuckle deep down in your belly and we'll go together like peanut butter and french fries. Not right now, french fries. I just remembered, I'm supposed to help hamburger with his hot dogs and I need to catch up. You get it? Catch up. Peanut butter walked up to one more someone who was practicing his ABCs. So before he could even open his mouth, Soup picked up a spoon, dipped it into himself, and then showed it to Peanut Butter. In the spoon were two letters, an N and an O. Nope. I didn't say anything yet, said Peanut Butter. You didn't have to, said Soup. No, oh, said Peanut Butter. That's definitely not kind, right guys? Anybody feeling bad for peanut butter? Peanut butter found a bench to sit on. He was almost ready to give up. But as he sat there, so very sad, a new kid walked up to him. Use your thinking, this is peanut butter. He keeps saying I'll make you chuckle deep down in your belly. What would be a word that would rhyme with belly and maybe go together with peanut butter? Any ideas? Hello, she said. Peanut butter took a deep breath. Um, hello, I'm new here and I'd like to play. Maybe now, maybe later or even all day. I'll make you chuckle deep down in your belly and we'll go together like peanut butter and jelly. Sure, I'll be your friend, said Jelly. But could you teach me how to keep the ball on my head? I'm only good with my feet. At the beginning, what did we figure out peanut butter was not good at? So they taught each other what they knew and made each other chuckle deep down in their bellies. It wasn't long before their laughing made the other kids come over. They asked if they could play too. Of course, Peanut Butter and Jelly were happy to let them join in. As his new friends knocked the ball around with their feet and their heads, and in one case, his buns, Peanut Butter chuckled deep down in his belly because they all went together like peanut butter and hamburger and cupcake and egg and meatball and french fries and soup and jelly. The end. I hope that you guys enjoyed this story. Sometimes reading is just for fun and teaches us all those things that we need to be a good friend. I love how peanut butter did not quit on meeting a new friend. That took a lot of courage and a lot of confidence something that's hard to do sometimes. I can't wait to meet all of you in person and give you big hugs when you come back to PBN. But for now, I hope that you enjoyed this book and maybe you have some favorite books in your, of your own. I can't wait to hear from you guys soon. Have a wonderful day. Bye.